right, so I'm gonna explain to you how to make money. All right, so I cooked up these um, these a couple articles using my sentence generator, and I'm basically gonna teach you how to not only uh, use the sentences that I can make and provide to you free of charge, uh, but also uh, have you experience some modicum of success on N4G because we all know that's what it's all about. We all know that. Um, so anyway, this is Politico Reach on N4G. Username yada yada yada. Um, yeah, so basically I was like, man, I can't, because the enthusiast press world we all know is if you've if you're any if you're in any way familiar <laughs> i'm kind of stumbling over my words here if you're in any way familiar with the state of the video game industry um you'll find that uh you know there's ign at the top and then there's like kotaku maybe GameSpot, and then and there's like maybe 10 there's like the t the difference between the number two and number one is like exponential and then it goes from there there's like a whole bunch of sites that occupy this like this like place of where they can hire uh where they're making enough money and have enough eyeballs on them to you know come out with uh to, to hire a an executive editor or an editor in chief and have like a staff in place. And then there's like hundreds of other sites that make enough money to like pay off their hosting charges every year. And that's it, if even that. And most of those sites that uh, fall into the latter category, uh, they end up here on N4G. You know, they're just, you know, minding their own business, you know, trying to survive and. What N4G is, it's a place where losers come to thrive. It's a place where, you know, people, uh, they basically go on here. It's like Reddit. They come here and post like, hey, you know, you should totally, like, watch this or, or look at this article and give me some more views. And, you know, provided people like it, they're like, okay, sweet. And then provided people don't like it, they're like, okay, no. So we end up with, like, a lot of um, websites like this one. And I don't know if you're familiar with these yet. I don't know if I'm that notorious at this point in time. I might be in the next few, next couple of weeks or so. But basically, you know, this is a catchy title. It's 140 degrees. Um, this is actually mine. I posted this. Politico Reach, you can see me right here, and uh, what I'm basically here to tell you is how to, how, why this post survived the gauntlet, the lottery of, of what N4G really is, because what N4G really is, is a lottery, you know, people go on there and they're just like, hey, I totally like the way that picture looks, plus one, and that's it, that's their, that's the extent of their logic, their justification. There's, it's, it's not, it's not meant that the articles that make it to the top don't make it there because they're the best. They make it there because they got enough upvotes. That's it. You know, I'm not, I'm not saying that you know the ones that end up on the very front page with a thousand degrees and whatnot are those are generally like you know decent articles and they've you know provided they've seen been exposed to enough eyeballs at least one of those people is going to be honest and be like hey this doesn't deserve to be here gone well you know there's this veritable like gray zone where up until like 250 degrees an article can kind of just like chill out in limbo and get, get you know kind of get views here and there and then you just kind of disappear, and that's it. And you know, this post right here, I put it up uh, 14 hours ago, 
and you know of course my audience is angry yeah. and they're kind of just like you know dude what the heck is going on you know i don't even know what to say and i'll, I'll tell you why they're saying that are you are you sure you are you ready for this well you don't have a choice now i mean i already clicked it i mean you can exit the video right now but no there we go um okay so look does this make any sense to you it sounds like banned poetry, doesn't it? Look at this. Do you see this? Are you seeing what I'm seeing right now? Are you insane? No, like... And you're probably wondering, you know, if you're... There's probably two ways to, you can interpret this. One, I'm, like, bastardizing the games industry. Two, I'm just, you know... I'm taking advantage of what BuzzFeed did for years you know BuzzFeed like basically invented the top 10 list and then showed it down our throats for like a decade and then now they're a legitimate news organization and no one cares no one bats an eyelash at that okay so what I, what am I gonna do I'm gonna do the exact same thing except my screw the content it's all about the titles you know screw it And then, you know, when you want to get a high enough Alexa rank, you, you switch over to a news organization, bam. Uh, can you see that Alexa rank up here? You can totally see that, can you? No, you can't see it. That's unfortunate. Anyway, I gotta go to uh, Alexa.com. So basically what I'm saying to you is... Um, Here's my traffic stats for this little enthusiast blog. This has been up for like, I made this blog about a week and a half ago, I want to say. No more than two weeks. And after two weeks, you know, you're probably wondering like, oh man, your, your, your global rank is probably like four million. <laughs> and you know, you're right. You're, you're absolutely right. Global rank is about 4 million, but my country rank is actually pretty good. Not bad for two weeks, you know. And I've been pumping out like, you know, 50 to 100 articles a day with all these catchy titles and whatnot, all thanks to my sentence generator. And this is one of those uh, pieces I was, uh, I'm telling you about. And I'm going to show you what it looks like to have it posted. Um, this is there's this thing called Selenium IDE. It's right here. It's a free download on a uh, on uh, Firefox. Uh, this is Chrome. Um, let's see, Firefox is totally open, isn't it? Can you see what I'm doing over here on Firefox? You can't see what I'm doing, can you? Um, yeah, Firefox is. Uh, 